introvert, or I was rather, and I saw a lot of the bad in people growing up, so it closed me off even more from everybody else. I, I, I didn't really interact with people as much as I could have when I was younger, and that led to a lot of anger and pain, and I picked up a terrible drug habit that stayed with me for a while. Then I got in the Marines, and so I picked up a huge drinking habit instead. Uh, I drank just about every day, just to kind of not remember anything ever. Uh, because when you're in pain, you don't want to feel it, you know? That got me into a lot of trouble, a lot of trouble. I, I had to go to rehab, I went to prison for a little bit, but I, I, I learned a lot through all that. Uh, it's, it's when you're at your lowest, you really stop being so selfish and, and see what really is going on. God was able to show me how people really are. When you strip somebody of absolutely everything, your rights, your clothes you wear, your style, and you're just, you're down to your base personality of what type of people you really are. You, you really, really begin to understand that everyone has their faults and flaws and qualities, and that's what you really love people for. You love them for the, the good and bad in them. Through all that, uh, God put my wife in my life, and she pulled me through everything. I was able to finally hold a job, and we own, own a place, and I don't have a terrible habit of drinking, and <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a normal functioning human being. And actually, God's blessed me with like this awesome job, which I love to get up in the in the morning and go to work. Like I really do. And He's allowing me to you know, be more active with people. I, I, I set up here every Sunday, every Sunday I can, anyways. And um, I'm able to donate and tithe and do better things and help others have a better life, which is awesome. It makes me feel great. I love helping people. <laughs>